Hey folks, hope y'all are doing well. I'm Karan Bandal from Econos Site. And in this video, let's talk about the renewable energy landscape in the world and solar power in India. We'll start with solar power. Recently, a report from global energy think tank Ember revealed that India has become the third largest solar power generator in 2023. It has surpassed Japan to move up the rankings. This is quite remarkable because not long back, that is in 2015, India ranked 9th. Look at India's solar power generation in a broader context. In 2023, India's total installed power capacity was a little over 400 gigawatts. That includes coal-based power, natural gas, hydro, wind, nuclear, solar, etc. Of that, installed solar power capacity was about 67 gigawatts or 16% of the total. And that year, solar energy made up roughly 6% of India's total electricity generation. You may ask then why the mismatch between installed capacity and actual generation? That's because solar power plants don't generate power 24 hours a day. When the sun shines, solar panels produce power. They work at the maximum efficiency for about 4 to 6 hours in a day. Therefore, actual solar power generation is almost always lower than the installed power capacity. Having said that, a roughly 6% contribution by solar energy in India's actual power generation is a huge leap up from 2015 when it was just half a percent. Just as we measure power capacity in gigawatts or terawatts, power generation or usage is measured in gigawatt hours or terawatt hours. In those terms, in 2023, India generated 77 terawatt hours of solar energy, 18 terawatt hours more than what the nation generated the year before. Only China, the United States and Brazil did better than India on this metric. While India has done well on adding solar power to its energy mix in recent years, there are three other global regions that have done much better than India. Look at the trend of installed solar power capacity for the United States, EU and China between 2010 and 2022. China has acquired a complete dominance in this space. As of 2022, total installed solar power capacity in China stood at a staggering 393 gigawatts, almost double that of EU's and over thrice that of the United States. Again, for reference, India's installed solar power capacity stood at roughly 67 gigawatts. If you see where these three started in 2000, China has seen an absolute explosion in the solar power growth in the last two decades. EU had a solid head start in 2000, but the region has fallen behind both the United States and China in expanding its solar power capacity. China even dominates the production of solar power components. It currently controls around 80% of world's solar panel supply chain. In 2022, China's solar industry employed over 2.5 million individuals, with over two-thirds of the jobs being in manufacturing and the remaining in construction, installation, and operations and management. Solar sector is a prolific job creator in the United States and EU as well. Solar industry employs over 600,000 individuals in the EU and over 250,000 in the United States. Let's wrap up with a big picture view. Here's a graphic that talks about the growth of renewable energy globally since 2000. The graphic sheds some light on how different world regions have done with respect to adding renewable power in their own energy mix. When we say renewable energy here, it includes not only solar, but wind, hydro, bioenergy, geothermal and marine energy. Since the year 2000, global renewable energy capacity has more than quadrupled to almost 4 terawatts as of 2023. That is a compound annual growth rate of 7.4%. Again, China has led this transition by adding a massive 1.4 terawatts of renewable power in this time, more than Africa, Europe and North America combined. During the same period, capacity growth in the United States has been a touch faster than the EU, but a lot slower than what China was able to achieve. However, 
US renewable growth is expected to accelerate due to the recently passed Inflation Reduction Act. And if you look at the developing economies, Africa's renewable capacity has almost tripled, while in India, it grew to over sevenfold. As of 2023, India's total installed renewable capacity stood at roughly 176 gigawatts. So a lot has changed in the global energy mix. A gradual move from conventional energy sources to newer renewable energy sources. But remember, power generation using renewable energy does not equal installed renewable power capacity because of the intermittent nature of these energy sources. Therefore, according to IRENA, renewable energy capacity needs to triple from its 2023 levels by 2030 to meet ambitious targets set by the Paris Climate Agreement. I hope you found this analysis interesting. I'll speak with you again next week. Until then, take care.